So for skincare, I have been really loving is this Family Dollar compared to Noxzema Deep Cleansing Skin Cream. And it, this really works just like Noxzema. It smells just like Noxzema, but it's a drugstore dupe. I have been loving is Clean and Clear Morning Burst. Now I love this morning burst because I've actually used this one is the regular facial scrub and then this one is the Shine Control Facial Scrub and this is the Shine Control Free and it's in the green packaging and this one is in the yellow packaging and I really really love both of these. So um, I also have been loving Clean and Clear Dual Action and Moisturizer. This is pretty much in every favorites video. This moisturizes dry skin, treats and helps prevent pimples and also applies your foundation, allows your foundation to apply on very smooth and I really really love it and I thought it was really cool of a product to keep your moisturized face, very, keep your face moisturized very well. Then I love the Appeal Cucumber Cleansing Tissues. I also use these to clean my face with. I normally switch up my routines at night just to test out and see how my face will react. Like tonight, I would either use this or this next product that I'm getting ready to show you that also has been a favorite throughout this month. And it is the St. Eyes. I got it for $2.50 at uh, Big Lots. And this is the St. Ice Fresh Better Naturally for Skin Makeup Remover and Cleansing. And I love it. It has a very natural scent. And I do not like scented products on my face. So this gives it a thumbs up because it's a great product. And I absolutely love it. So also for skincare. And this is a lotion. And it is called shea butter and i talk about this in pretty much my tutorials etc this is a really really good lotion to have especially if you are dry skin so i really really love that so that was skincare and now let's get on to To makeup now for makeup I've been really trying out different products so I'm gonna start with my eyeshadow palettes and I've been loving the 28 neutral palette from Coastal Scents and it just have like very very gorgeous neutral colors you can create any looks with this palette and I absolutely love it I love how when I was on vacation in April I actually had enough shadows to create any look for the event for the captain's ball for any type of look I had you guys can tell that I hit pan this color here and this color here and that color there because those are the colors that you mainly see me using in my tutorials so also I've been loving which is the BH cosmetics palettes and these are from their California makeup collection And I don't have a review on these two, but I do have a review and a tutorial on this one. And I have some mixed reviews and tutorials on this one and my Get Ready With Me's. And also, I have, I'm going to do a blog post about all three palettes if you guys are wondering about them. Next, I have been really loving my e.l.f. Mineral Eyeliner. Excuse me. Eyeshadow Primers. I love the e.l.f. Mineral Eyeshadow in Sheer. See, this is a regular primer and sheer, and this is the mineral. Only difference, this is a larger package than the mineral, but they work well. I've been loving my e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set Spray. I use to set my face before I go to work and basically throughout the day or if I have it in my little carry-on bag or just carry around bag. Like I just apply this to the bag and just spray, spray, spray throughout the day and it works very well. For mascaras, I have really been obsessed with the Maybelline Mega Plush Volumizer Mascara and then also the Rocket
mascara by Maybelline New York and I know I said I didn't like this one in the mascara showdown but it took me a while to get used to these so I have to say I've been loving this and also I got a new mascara that I have been loving it is the CoverGirl Last Perfection mascara in very black and I love it because it's just it works just like the makeup blush it gives a natural look and it just works for anyone so lastly but not least I have been loving my Revlon pressed powders I'm about out of the medium deep and it looks like this I almost hit panned it and then I am just now using the one in medium it's just a tad bit lighter I've been loving my MAC painterly paint pot I have been using this in pretty much some of my tutorials but not all I just use it as a base then I've been loving this NYX blush and peach Not really intimidating, but it's just a nice color for my sisters out there. And also, I have been loving lately is I have been really reaching for the CoverGirl Clean Whip Foundation. This is really good. I mean, I have it all right now, and it's absolutely lovely. And I have an online review on my channel, and also I have a world press review on my blog. So I am in a shade. 365 Tawny and my last two favorites have been my Maybelline 24 hour color type 2 in the shade back to the bronze I really love this color it's awesome and I have been loving my LA colors um, my stick foundation in the shade nude it's awesome and then lastly to sum up all the favorites I have been really, really, really loving and enjoying my Revlon concealer. It's a liquid concealer, and it's the Revlon Color Stay Blemish Concealer in the shade Lights. I love it. It's like a perfect concealer, and I will do a online review if I haven't did a video of it yet. So I will definitely go go to Real Press for videos that I haven't posted, but I will do it on online. It was my July favorites and hopefully you guys enjoy it and I will talk to you guys later and I promise I get back on schedule. Bye!